In lesson 2 we learned a lot of new chords with the purpose of getting used to the sound of them. In lesson 3 we gonna use these chords and put them into a musical context. We're doing so by using the technique of chord substitution, which means we have a line or a sequence of basic chords like major, minor, diminished, dominant 7 and we're gonna replace all these chords with the chords we just learned. The first is a chord sequence in the key of G major. So much for lesson 3. In lesson 4 we will work with more examples of chord substitutions.